Hey guys, uh, last video of the day, right? Um, okay, so I have a quick question. Actually, maybe a couple. I'm not sure yet. Uh, do you like to hang up big clunky shelves? No, like no one does. Do you like to do do-it-yourself projects? Yeah, of course, because I can do it myself project. I came up with a project that you can do for only the cost of, I want to say 71 popsicle sticks and some hot glue and optional paint, okay? Alright guys, you may have figured it out by now, I'm going to show you guys how to make a really cool shelf that is super stable and awesome and I've got one hanging up in the background right now. You might be able to see it, might not. It's got an Ant-Man on it, right? Okay, let me go get that real quick. Boom. Here it is. I made this shelf. This is a Popsicle Stick Shelf. That's what I'm going to call this. The Popsicle Stick Shelf. Hard to say. And the triangle, obviously. It's just a bit thick. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight Popsicle Sticks thick. Ant-Man's so cool. We all know it. Ultron head. Antony. That's a spoiler if you haven't seen Ant-Man. I'm sorry. It's not that big of a spoiler, but just a bit. Okay, I'm going to show you guys how to make one of these. And then... Awesome stuff like that. And then I'll show you where I got this from, because this is kind of cool. Okay, so let's get into this. Alright guys, in order to make an awesome shelf like this, uh, you're going to need two of these. Now what are these? These are stick boards that I made. Uh, and you're probably like, but Jacob, admin guy, whoever you are, uh, we don't know how to make those boards because you didn't show us and you came up with it all by yourself and you're so smart. Oh, you're basically a genius. Well, well thank you kind people. And I will show you how to make these. But I'm only going to show you one because if I show you one, then I've shown you both basically. Okay, uh, I don't like this one. Alright, I'm going to show you how to make one of them. And then you're just going to take what you did times two, basically. You need... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. You need 12 sticks per side, so that makes that 24 sticks per board. So, I need 24 good sticks. You only need 24 sticks to make one of these bad boys. Uh, let me show you how we do this. Okay. Here's what we're gonna do. You're gonna take three sticks. Move all of them off to the side. You're gonna take three sticks. I like to see them at a right angle. So, oh wait, yeah. Let's grab this piece of paper here. So I'll put one down, put another one down, another one by the desk, uh, right angle, okay. Now we're going to put a dot of glue on this, just a dot, and we're going to put, we're going to overlap the first one that we laid down and this one, like that. Uh, but look, now this one really isn't all too connected. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to take our hot glue gun. We're going to load it up on the glue on this side. We're going to take this. We're going to stick it right there. And boom. Now it's connected. And this is uh, hanging over on that side. Now we just layer them up on this side like we just put the dot there put one there and then we hold it down make sure that it is straight for a couple seconds there we go 
and then we just keep going. You should have 11 going this way. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. That's how you know you did it right. And that you didn't pick out some bad sticks. Okay. Now we're just going to flip it over. And see how we're doubled up right here. We're going to put glue all the way going down on that. So it'll be all good. Okay, so now this side's all secure, not going to go anywhere, but these are all kind of like, kind of still flimsy. So on this part right here that it sticks out, we're going to take a stick and we're just going to glue it down to all that so that it stays pretty sturdy. Uh, just take what you did and times by two because I'm not going to make another one because I have one right here. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to take some other sticks. We're just going to line them up. Okay. Uh, only three, four, five sticks. That's all you're going to need. You're broken. Go four and five. Oh, wait. I don't like you. You're fine. Take your bottom piece. Go like that. Put a stick on it. Okay, although we only have two sticks left, I'm going to go ahead and connect this. So I'm going to turn this sideways, put the glue on the sticks that we just put on there, stick side up, and you should get something similar to this. Five should be enough to keep it pretty, you know, good. Put three sticks up here to hold the name thing. So if you want to do that, you can. If not, no big deal. I think I'm going to do it, so I'll do that real quick. So yeah, you can glue them together like that and then stick them on if you would like. That's not going to go anywhere. What you need is the thing that holds it on the wall, and that would be this really thick triangle back. You need 18 sticks to make this triangle. And I'll show you how. Okay, like that. Stack of six.
this here is our wall or our back, whatever you want to call it. This is the side that the triangle will be on. Or take the bottom of our triangle, it doesn't matter which one you take, I'm just taking this one. And we're going to glue it right here. This here just keeps stability in it when it's off the wall. You want to count to the very middle and then that's where you want it to be angled. So there are 11 here, so we're going to count over 5 and then halfway on the 6th. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then halfway on the 6th. So it'll be on this one. So we're going to put our glue down about halfway there and then we're just going to draw a nice little line and boom. That one has to be perfect. It just has to have the correct start and the correct end. Now all we're going to do is connect the dots. Okay, um, and if you want to, just to like make sure that it's secure, take your glue gun and then just go along the edge. Okay, now our shelf is constructed. Now, on to the optional parts of this video. Okay, we've got it at a safe distance away, so now we're going to start spraying it. Once again, this here, this part, it's all optional. Now that this is painted, I'm going to let it dry for a couple minutes, and I'll bring it inside and finish it up. Alright guys, I waited 11 minutes, because that's just the number that I... That's just the number. So, that's basically the shelf. Uh, I can show you how to put it up, just I'm gonna do one more thing to customize it. Action figures. Let me show you how to do this. Oh, I need scissors, I need to go get some scissors. All right, I'm back. Where's some scissors, okay. Now, if you ever get toys or whatever you wanna do, I like to cut out the bio for the character. Oh, gosh, so far away. I like to cut out the bio for the character, Spider-Man, 2099. Then I like glue it right there, whatever. So I just applied the glue, put the thing or what's it on it. Then I press down, and boom, there it is. So then I can put Miguel O'Shea. <coughs> Oh gosh, it sounded like I said a bad word, but I said Miguel O'Shea. I just, like, my voice got to me. So, now, he's like this. So let's hang it up on the wall. Alright guys, uh, there's the Ant-Man one that I made earlier. Uh, not earlier, but you know what I mean. That I've made before. Okay, uh, oh, I don't have one from, for them yet. I'm just, you know, working on it. Okay, uh, so here's where the triangle comes in. We're going to take attack, like this. Focus on the attack. Yes, attack, like this. We're going to put it into the wall. Uh, let's see how right there looks. I'm not sure. So here's where the triangle comes into play. The triangle is just going to hook onto the attack. Boom, I almost got that perfectly even. Pretty close, All right. So then, boom. And, of course, got to put the hobgoblin sword up there, and the arm. Check it out. You know what? I should probably switch that because Ant-Man's right here. Okay, hold up. Okay, boom. There we go. Now Ant-Man's next to Ant-Man and Spider-Man's next to Anti-Venom and Daredevil. I just, like I said before, haven't made one for them yet. <sighs> okay. Back to over there. So there you guys have it. Uh, that was the third video for the day. Hmm. Pretty cool, right? Hey, look. You can still see them right back here. Uh, Ant-Man, Spider-Man, Anti-Venom, Daredevil. Okay, see you guys in my next video, and I will see you later.